Silence is your only protection. But we're not meant to be victims. We're meant to be at the top of the food chain, using our intelligence to overcome brute force. Using that intelligence, we can turn a low-cost everyday item like this into something any graboid... No, Twitch, I'm not being a smart ass. Bert thinks it may be an ass blaster. Using a system of locomotion... No, there hasn't been a graboid, but... Or shriekers either, damn it, just listen. All I'm saying is make sure nobody else gets in the valley till we got this thing under control. What a... Dick putts? Dick putts, perfect. The next subject I was going to cover was how to orient yourself using a stick as a sundial. Why not use a compass? Well, you don't have a compass. This isn't going to work. There are too many concepts you're simply not equipped to... Own. English, Rosalita, English. Not necessary. Yo comprendo loud and clear. It's an ass blaster. You are so damn right. I'm guessing it paid you a visit. A visit? A visit is when a friend comes by for tequila shots. This was more like, like... An ass blaster attack. <sighs> you said it was in your shed? Harlow smokes meat in there. I guess it's, it, it honed in on the heat and... Uh, and that's well, when you swam away from it? No, I jumped in my water tank. Hmm? I figured, you know, if, I, if I'm underneath the water, I can't see my body heat. So. How long did you have to hold your breath? I didn't. I used one of these. It saved my life. All right, we've got to go after this big bird. Is it more like goose hunting or turkey hunting? <laughs> and then I kicked him, and he was out. Gentlemen. The current emergency will temporarily require the attention of Mr. Gummer, so we will continue the curriculum as planned under the guidance of Ms. Sanchez, our survival school self-defense instructor. Jody. Uh... Bert. Gentlemen, so let me show Bert. you this one. We go jump up and kick. You're not thinking you're going out alone. Sorry, this isn't the same as fighting shriekers. It's twice as dangerous. Yeah, well. So it's driving a Chrysler 360 small block 130 miles an hour around a dirt track at Big H. I have no idea what you're talking about. But here. You don't mind, Bert. You drive a little cautious. 